I got another story that's going to make you say you simply can't make this up. All right. A school in Nebraska is now apologizing to students and parents after a chef in the school's cafeteria added an exotic meat to the chili. By exotic, I mean kangaroo. Oh, for heaven's sake. <laughs> the chef, who is no longer employed at the school, says he used the meat, the kangaroo meat, because it's known to be lean and nutritious. But now the superintendent for the school says the meat does meet the USDA standards. He says it's not that the meat's unhealthy or dangerous, but it's not a normal staple for our diet, and it shouldn't be served in the school. He mentioned that if a family wants to try exotic foods, you know, they have every right to do so sure. on their own time, but it shouldn't be in their cafeteria, and this is not the time or place to do it. All right. Um, what do you think about this? Eh, gross. I just, like, why? How did this even happen? Who would think in their right minds it'd be okay to order kangaroo meat? Without, it, you should be telling parents at least it should be on the menu. I think it should just be on the menu. That's what I would, I guess that's kind of my opinion on this. I think as a chef or a cook, you can make anything. And in, in this case, it was safe to eat. Yeah. He ordered it through the, I mean, schools yes. ordered through mm -hmm. a, um, you know, whatever you call that, a service. And I, I'm not saying I'm for eating kangaroos. I'm not <laughs> saying that by any means. But I think he has every right to put it on the menu. And guess what? If, if kids still eat it, kids still buy it. He can put it on the menu mm -hmm. again, and if he doesn't, he probably shouldn't. He lost his job for this. I think that's yeah. sad. And I think that the parents probably made a bigger stink out of it than they should have. Maybe What's <laughs> wrong with trying new things? I, I, every year I go to an exotic game dinner where it's all, um, it's all foods that you don't normally eat. And a lot of it's normally like buffalo and moose yeah. and things like that. Um, but I'm, I think trying new things and, and teaching kids to, to go out of their comfort zones, not necessarily a bad thing. And uh, I don't think this guy should have lost his job for it. Yeah, I mean, I guess you're right, but they should have been made aware. But they should—it should, it should have been on the menu, and maybe it will be. And they're telling us we have to move on. But I'm telling you, I think that it should, as long as he puts it on the menu and there's transparency, it should be fine.